you. Thank you very much, Paul. We're ready to get ourselves into game two between Team Secret and Maneski, and the drafts are out. Final pick. That's so leveled. For an offlane hero, this is amazing. If he was here by himself at the start, Undyne or Winter Wyvern could have sold, uh, sold his own. They want to go straight in with the Mana Blade. Doesn't do a lot of damage, level one, but it looks with the Splinter Blast and the Tombstone. They're going to get the first blood, and it will go the way of Cuckoo there. So Maneski finding what they were looking for and, and finally managing to get a kill on the board. Night Stalker will be looking for that urn. And Misery, oh, he's, he's more than halfway towards getting those arcanes. And they'll continue to trade the farm. Maybe at this point we'll see the supports be okay. And big top lane. Very nice and team. Managed to move in there with the Sonic Wave and they managed to do it in tandem with the Dark Sea. So uh, sorry, Ryo's been having a great time at the top. Level 7. Uh, he's really recovered from the fact that he was getting a rest back at the start. He's starting to get that CS. Envy looking to wrap around potential. Same time mid lane, they're going down Parlight Down with the focus fire, they'll get it. Raging Potato picks up that kill. A second pick off now for Maneski. If they want to try and turn Sonic Wave is up as well. If Maneski come too close uh, to this tide hunter, Misery may just want to look to pop it. They're coming up the lane. Misery's there hiding. He's gonna move forward. There's your ravage. Sonic Wave to follow up as well. Trade in the middle. There's one. They get the Shadow Strike out to Potato. They did get the win run off, but I'm sure they'll chase this down for a second kill. TP reactions are coming through, and that's gonna be enough to turn this. They're gonna force Misery back. They've got the Arctic Burn slowed down. Envy's still sticking about for this. In oh, he fact, back he blinks in. forward. He wants to try and get the kill, but he oh, can't quite close the gap. And now really he slows can. on him. Envy it's could so be close. in trouble. He's desperate Our for the kill. One. There we go. He does get it, but now has he got, is he gonna be able to get himself out? He's got a TP. He's gonna blink in two seconds. I think he's gonna be fine. He's gonna get away with this. He blinks. He TPs. He got oh, the kill man. and he gets himself home. Envy. That was looking that scary, man. That attack. Arctic burn. We are on pilot die here on the side of secret. We'll see if they can get the jump here. Don't. Are they gonna be able to do this though? Because the fairly tanky Pilot is caught between three. Jesse Vash is also moving in. Pilot Eye looking to see if he can take the curry. He's gonna pop the Night Tower, but the slows are too much. He's trying to get himself out of there, but the vacuum's down and they'll get themselves the Night Stalker. So they take down the NS. He will be out for the count. To find the tier one trade and boosted travel now. Picked up here on this and they, ooh, Misery's thinking about it, but Raging Potato with that haste drain. A little bit too speedy. Oh, the shackle on Emmy! Oh, latching Perfect shackle on the Ravage. Damage though with the Witcher's oh, Curse, they should do as well. They'll take the kill onto Envy. Lovely play there from Raging and Jules. And they'll try and look for more. Chasing down Misery here with this haste drain. There's your boosted travel. Weha coming oh, in. The Ravage. And he's going to look for the Rages. He takes down the kill onto Wind Ranger. They'll try and see if he can get some more. And meanwhile, in the mid lane, Puppy's caught out by them. But it'll shallow grave himself. Heal up as well. Looking for the Rages onto Jules getting himself into the sidelines. Well, he lived. In the mid lane, Puppy lived. He got himself out. And now Jesse Vash trying to chase back onto Pylite Dine. It looks like it will just be Envy and Potato going down there. No one else to fall. Want to wait for that before they try and fight again. Instead, they just. Are they just going to go? Focus on mid. Smoke was used by Secret. They're going to come from the back. Jesse Vash yeah. in trouble. Yeah, drops down the tombstone here. They'll focus that. Take yes, it down. Mid. There's your curse. They're they want to misery. The wall's down as well. It's a lot of illusions. But Weave comes out here from Puppy. Ravager Secret's fight. still looking pretty good. They're focusing the attention towards the target. He'll pop the mech, but he's going to get popped himself. That's the dark seed down. Puppy shallow graving himself. Mech comes through misery. There's your mana void. Secret's going to fall here. And this illusion here of the shadow. He's doing a fair bit. We are looking for the record. The Sonic Wave as well. He's actually going to hold on to the record because they don't need it. Double kill for the SF as he manages to raise down the Undying as well. And looks like this one will end as a three for one and Secret do come out on top, even though it was a very nice cut. It's going to be a while until Winter's Curse really feels strong other than for the stand, uh, the um, defensive standpoint, like the fact that it stuns. Pile I die, moving in top. Shackle's not going to latch to get the silence onto Raging Misery and MBR there as well. They'll look to get the kill on the Wind Ranger and they'll get it. He's now down for 50 oh. seconds. No stun. Tis mine. Well, Pile I die leading it in towards Dying the mid. He's gonna get Weeha coming in with his Shadow Blade. And Darkseid could be in trouble there if they get the void. So the mid lane puppy's being chased. Look at the fear. There's your void. And here's the damage here from this Shadow Fiend. Weeha now dominating as he picks up yeah. yet another kill. Not gonna feel too bad about it. Oh, Raging Potato. He needs to get himself out. He's got a win run. He's got a TP and hope for the best. He's looking to hide here. Can they get the cancel? Can they get the vision? Oh, yes, they can. They've got the void out, and that's going to be Potato going down. Another pick off for Secret. What a huge kill.
So that'll be eggs for Wind Ranger, but Radiant's one four and one on a hero that can do a lot of damage. This is looking bad. Ult on Misery mid. Ish. I got Kuku moving in as well, but Misery is just gonna pop the greaves and try and walk it off. Edge oh, around the so way one to four. Misery will still oh, go back. down. Secret, do they have the follow up to clean this one up? They've got a cold embrace okay. onto Kuku, keeping him alive. Envy trying to move this forward with the screen burst. They can't Radiant's quite get the anti mage Shadow Strike's gonna tick him down. He's gonna look for the TP back to base, and he's gonna be all right. Gets himself back to the fountain. So secret, even though the combo was there, it just wasn't enough damage to get right, cool. Each one is 100 gold. So that's 500 gold that one of these supports doesn't have. The Undying to be specific. And this guy's nothing. He's got a Wands and an Arcane Boots. And he's forced to buy all these because he bought a, an extra 25% that he can throw on the Shadow Fiend when Shadow Fiend goes high disgusting. So secret is very likely to go do some pushing here. Oh, or they'll wait until they this ages. mid, but there is a sentry. Jules is going to see it, but he's going to see his own demise potentially. He will drop the Winter's Curse, but Puppy and Pilai die there. They'll clean up the Wyvern. I don't think that was worth it. I mean, he could have ulti TP'd. I guess he also had the Glimmer Cape, but... Oh, Manta is there for Cuckoo. He's going to blink back, but he blinks into Misery, and Misery does have a Ravage if they want to try and control the aim, and they will. They'll pop the Ravage, they get right, the damage there with the physical burst from Puppy. It counts as a double kill as he moves across from that Wyvern kill in the mid lane. Ice is, so good. is looking to be that unstoppable force at this point. Ice, look at the racks just melt. There's a focus fight, but he just doesn't care. It's not doing any damage with the Solar Crest laid down onto Weeha. He's evading half of the shots. They'll attempt for a shackle, they'll move Cuckoo in. But he just turns around and hits back at the anti and They've got to walk themselves back off. This is the reason Shadow Fiend is so popular right now and seen so valuable. They'll oh, run the side, Jesse Bash. Bash. They'll drop a wall here, Maneski, but they've lost the Undying. We are just playing around the wall. There's going to be the mid lane racks gone. And now they head down to the bottom to look for more. Cuckoo Man. blinking out. And Envy's going to blink forward. Cuckoo popping the Manta. They'll get the silence on the right one. Envy's lost a lot of mana. He will now pop the BKB. Try and right click back onto Cuckoo. They'll take down the Anti Mage. Unstoppable for Weeha as he also takes down the Winter Wyvern. And only two left on the map here for Maneski. Secret. Pretty insane. Yeah, game one, we saw them struggle a bit in the other game against Maneski, but they turned it up for the late game, and, and in this game, Secret, they've been turned on from the start. They're, they are just completely outclassing Maneski in this game. They got so much more farm after. There's the Ravage initiation. Straight in, and they'll look to find some kills with this one. Right, we'll pop the Greaves. There'll be a buyback from anti Mage. Nice mana void on 10. The Envy will blink himself out. They'll pop the Manta. Look towards Misery. It's a vacuum, but there's no wall to follow up at this point. And Puppy's there with the Shadow Waves. They'll heal themselves back up on Weeha. Just continues to sit there, go for the objectives, hit Zorax, and they'll take a second set down away from the side of Maneski hit. Top two, top three teams in the entire tournament. They they're very far behind this game. And there we go. MP just moving forward. There's an MKB now on Wehar as well. It's just getting scary and scary. And Maneski are smoked up. They're gonna look for an engagement. They've got all the ultimates. It's misery, the one that's revealing himself at the moment in the lane. At the same time, Envy, oh, Envy's going to find the pick of one to Room Ranger. So they've already taken out Raging Potato. Cuckoo, uh, blink himself out, and they'll enter the fire here. Envy, they'll drop the ball on him, but the BKB's out from the man. There's just Sonic Wave flying through. Does actually clip both Jewels and the Darks here. They'll get off the, the Winter's ulti. Curse. Envy might Turning die. on to Envy, can they actually kill him in time? No, it's a double kill for Envy. Monster kill streak for Weehar. Make that a triple kill. And Secret playing on a totally different level to that of Mineski in this game and they take it 33 minutes in 20 to 7 purge they they made that look pretty straightforward honestly won all their lanes got the items they needed yeah they died here and there Mineski had a couple good ganks and stuff like that but they just consistently stayed ahead in farm in warding they always knew where their opponents were